Today is taking a stand against gun violence advocacy day. It is a statewide effort by the group Ceasefire PA. And a little bit of rain in Harrisburg did not deter gun safety advocates and Governor Tom Wolf from rallying outside the state capitol earlier this afternoon. Erie News Now State Capitol correspondent Brendan Scanlon was at the rally. He joins us live to tell us about their message. Brendan. Well, good evening, Mike and Eva. And yeah, it definitely was not the best day to forget your umbrella and your rain jacket, uh, which I did. But that rain did not deter nearly 200 rally goers from showing up on the outside stairs of the Capitol today with a very clear message to the state legislature as gun violence continues to impact nearly every part of this Commonwealth. We need help. Today, advocates and lawmakers came together to call on the Republican Majority General Assembly for more gun safety legislation in Pennsylvania. And the excuses have got to end. House Minority Leader Joanna McClinton was among the Democratic lawmakers in attendance with a clear message for their Republican colleagues. To all of my colleagues across the aisle, I said action has to happen. Governor Tom Wolf said his pen is ready to sign more legislation to reduce gun violence. There has been recently a tragic spike in gun violence. Wolf's calling on the General Assembly to pass several measures that would require gun owners to report lost or stolen firearms within 72 hours, temporarily remove firearms from someone who is at risk of hurting themselves or others, close loopholes in background checks, and require safe storage requirements. These are common sense measures. These are things that people all across the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania support. Pennsylvania has one of the most stringent gun background check laws in the entire country. House Republican Caucus spokesperson Jason Gossman says surging gun violence is largely driven by Democratic policies and lack of local enforcement. Right now there are people who are on the streets uh, and are violent criminals and are dangerous individuals as a result of progressive prosecutors not enforcing the law. He says current gun laws should be enforced before new ones are introduced. If they're not enforcing the laws on the books now, why would they enforce new laws? Why would they enforce new criminal statutes? And this week, House Republicans are pushing a bill of pack or a package of bills on their own, which in their words gives Pennsylvanians smart justice uh, for a safer Commonwealth. They say the bills ensure laws are enforced and that victims of crime are, uh, have access to the rights that they have been afforded. They're actually debating those bills right now as they just start the wrap-up session here in the House. So we'll continue to monitor that package of bills and bring you any updates once they become available. But for now, live inside the state capitol for Erie News Now, I'm Brendan Scott.